Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate like on LinkedIn using Socinator. Liking targeted posts is a great way to engage fellow LinkedIn users. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right click on your LinkedIn account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the account configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on LinkedIn through Socinator. Let's scroll to the right and click like. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to like a number of posts within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for like activity. Let's start with the first one, search query. As the name suggests, Search Query allows you to command the software on how to search targeted posts to like. There are two important sections, Query Type and Query. Query Type defines how you want to search the post. You can select the Query Type by clicking the drop-down button. Once you have selected your Query Type, enter the query either manually by typing in this area, or you may click this button to import from CSV or text file. Select the right file and click Open. And when you're done, click Add Queries to the list and it will be added to the Queries list over here. To show you how this works, let's test each query type. The first one is Someone's Posts, so we need a specific LinkedIn profile URL for this one. Let's say this one for example. Let's copy the profile URL, paste it in the query box, and click add queries to the list and it will target this specific profiles posts the second one is my connections posts so there's no need to put anything in the query box because it will automatically target the posts of your LinkedIn connections so simply click add and it will be added to the queries list over here you can add several query types and queries depending on your preferences if you want to delete a query from the list, simply click the trash bin button on the right side of the query you want to remove. Let's say My Connections Posts. Click it and it's gone. The next configuration category is Job Configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should like posts. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like Slow with an average daily activities of 12, medium with 21, fast with 41, or super fast with 83. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each post is liked. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after liking the number of posts you set in number of likes per job. Number of likes per job will allow you to specify the number of LinkedIn posts you want to like per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of posts to like per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of max likes per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep liking posts even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on let's say Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click add interval and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day. Let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. Click Add Interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it LinkedIn Like. Click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time and choosing LinkedIn Like. The next one is User Filters. This allows us to filter the users whose posts we want to like. The first one will target only those who have profile pictures. 
The next one will target those who have at least 500 connections. Check the third one if you want to target those who have enabled advanced bio and skills. The fourth one will allow us to specify the minimum number of characters in the bio, let's say five for example. The next one, must contain specific words, will allow us to specify the words that should be in the bio description. Let's say you want to target expert for example. So type it in this area. You may import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Select the right file and click open. If you want to delete, you may also click the clear all button and it's gone. When you're done, click the save button over here. The next one is the opposite of the previous one, must not contain specific words. So if you check it, you can specify the words that should not be in the bio description. Let's say you don't want to target fresh graduate, for example. Type it in this area. Again, you may clear or import using these buttons. And when you're done, click Save. The next one will allow you to specify the minimum number of skills. Let's say 5. And check the following if you want to target users with experience and education details. The last tool is Manage Blacklisted Users. Blacklisted users are the LinkedIn accounts you do not want Socinator to interact with. In this case, Socinator will not like the posts of the blacklisted users when you check this box. So this can either be a private blacklist, which belongs to a specific LinkedIn account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. When you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start liking posts on LinkedIn, let's scroll up and click Save success then click the status button to make it active now that it's active let me show you another option in automating like on linkedin using socinator this one allows us to create campaigns which is perfect for multiple accounts to start let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop down button and select linkedin this will take us to the accounts tab let's switch to the engage tab and select like on the left side of the app. Here we can name our campaign. Let's call it LinkedIn like. For query type, let's choose someone's posts and use the same profile link from earlier. Click add. For job configuration, let's select slow. For user filters, let's choose must have profile picture, 500 plus connections, and those with experience and education details. Finally, let's skip blacklisted users, private blacklist. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple LinkedIn accounts. Since you only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click the box of the account and the save button. This will automatically bring us to the Campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our LinkedIn like campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.